Hi guys, uh, just a quick video. Uh, been out to a few uh, ATS fault calls this weekend. This one had uh, two of the left lights were flashing rapidly. Uh, tried solving it, tried calling Texcom tech support and they couldn't and get it working either. It didn't have an IP address. So what I've done is I've ripped out all the guts and bought it downstairs. Uh, connected to the flash player and connected it in via the ethernet. So what we've done that then is plugged it in, as I said, so that we've got a hard wire instead of using the Wi-Fi. I've just got a code now, which is, means it is connected and working. So I've gone onto the cloud and forced an update. Jeez, there, as you can see, update coming up. So it's now doing a firmware update. But before I did that, what I did was I connected the, uh, the flash drive and Flash the firmware on the panel from version 5 to 6 because version 5 seems to be a problem child recently. I defaulted that is by pressing that button 20 times rapidly. And obviously, like I said, I've just connected your Ethernet cable and fired up a firmware update via the cloud. So, hopefully, in a minute or two, it should start working. Alright, so uh, now I'm connected to Wi Fi. The firmware is all updated as you can see. If I just go back onto the keypad, Exit, and I'm on Wi-Fi this time, so if I press yes, hopefully I should get an app code. Before, when I was trying to do this, it wasn't giving me a code at all, but as you can see there, it's got one now. It was just trying and attempting to make a call, but failing. But thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe.